Uh, so mom and I are down in the barn. It's beautiful. Been working not on, you can only have an outdoor shower. So they had a curtain that blew on you, it was cold. We had these old posts from camp out seven years ago. We strung around the grassy area here for a camp out. And they were just sitting over there. Cory and Emily had, I think they have seven or eight picnic tables, old. Some you can't sit on anymore. So I'm refurbishing those. I've taken apart four, burning the excess stuff that's not usable. One was completely toast. I couldn't use one piece out of it, but out of four so far, and I don't know how many it's gonna take. I'm gonna string them, run them this way, and then go around the corner, run some this way, and then you'll enter through there. That shower caddy won't be there, of course, but I had no place to put it. So you hear the horses in the background. It's a beautiful morning. Uh, let's walk over here. There's a decent table underneath the chest set, which which you just saw on the time lapse. I don't really want to take that apart. So I'm going to see. I think there's two more up front by the garage or by that tree. Um, it's going pretty good. I don't know. Copper, where are you going? What are you doing? This one was unusable completely, which I'm going to load in the truck. I'm going to talk about Clyde. Clyde, Clyde. Don't eat grass. That table was toast. It came apart in 30 seconds. So we'll have to load that in the truck and burn it. I think mom's up getting her coffee. Huh. It looks better in the yard already just by getting rid of all those old tables. This one. It's in pretty good shape. I mean, I need the wood. So I got to call Corey. I don't know if he'd ever want to sit on it or not. I don't think so. It's pretty toast. I'm going to make an executive decision. Take it apart. All right. It's March 12th, I think. And Saturday morning. Missed my Lincoln. I'm going to try FaceTime him.